All right, so I'm out at my buddy's place. We got a lot of freezing rain last night. It made driving in pretty interesting. So uh, it's a bit later in the day just because I wanted to give the roads time to clean up, clear up. And so this one's just going to be a quick one. Run out, check sets, call it good. So let's get to it. Come up, check it out real fast, just to make sure everything's all go pathetic. And it looks well enough, so I'm gonna leave it alone. Water slide. So until I get some snowfall, this set's probably not going to produce anything, which that's fine. Fuck, that's deep.
Hey, there you are. Tree, tree, you fucker. And we're done. Oh, shot his tail off again. And now we're out of here, for real this time. just because, well, there's a lot of stuff I had on my plate at that moment. So I was pretty wrapped in thought. Uh, you guys will get a bit more context to that later on.
All my sets are empty. Time to go check the last one. And then I'm getting out of here. Hasn't been an exciting video, of course, and I haven't talked a whole lot, but I've had a lot on my mind for the last day and a half. So, I don't know if you guys can see it, but somebody on some cross-country skis, or what have you, don't really care what kind of skis they are, somebody on skis came from across the, they came from across the river on this side, which absolutely blows my mind because this ice has not been safe and if they would have tried to go one more day they would have definitely been going through but uh, somebody came across the river on skis came all the way down checked out this set right here and then they came from across the river up upstream checked out basically all of the sets that i had across there I don't know what the deal is. Do I need to put out cameras for uh, somebody who's just out putzing around with nefarious intentions? Because I've already had one trap stolen this year. I'm not trying to have any more. I don't know what's going on, but either way, it's got me all uh, wigged out. So I am strongly debating how much further my season is going to be going out here. Because come very soon, I think it's going to be time for me to pull my line and call it a day. Yep, still there. Back to the truck. morning so it's about uh, it's early afternoon now getting out a little bit later in the day gonna have a nice slow easy day well, let's get to it So good.
Somebody's been back through again. Well, I guess that settles it. I'm pulling traps from this location. Whoever is on these cross country skis came back and I don't know what the deal is, but I want no part of it. So I'm pulling my line and my foothold trapping season is officially coming to a close because of it. I'm gonna start focusing more on water trapping closer to My, my apartment. And go from there. It is unfortunate that I cannot continue out here, but I don't trust whatever the fuck is going on. Even a little bit. I'm not even gonna bother checking the other one because I know it's empty. I'm gonna get back to the truck, grab my anchor puller, and come back out and get every set. So that actually concludes my uh, foothold season, my first real foothold season. Overall, I'd say it's pretty good, aside from having traps stolen dealing with all that crap and the bobcat which was unfortunate i have very little complaints uh, i do continue spring trapping for a little while there for beaver and whatever else is legal but uh not too much comes from that i've got some adc work coming on down the line not a ton just because but there's a little bit of uh, spring beaver and adc work footage coming out sooner or later uh, thanks for joining me, y'all. See you in the next one. Peace.